In this tutorial in CyberLink PowerDirector, I'd like to show you how to create a square video, one with a one-to-one -one ratio height to width. Now, I'm using the brand new version of PowerDirector version 18, which enables you to do this. You will also get these features if you upgrade and you're a 365 subscriber. So let me show you how to do that. First of all, we have a typical movie here. It's 16 by 9 and I can play it and it's a great shot. But let's assume we want to apply it to Facebook or Instagram or some other context where we're looking to make it one to one ratio. How do we do that? Well, I click on the top and I click on edit. And then I click down to aspect ratio. Now my default is 16 by 9, but now I have a new feature called one to one. If I click on that, it will recreate it as a square. And if I produce it as it is, I will have a one to one video. But notice I will also have black on the top as well as on the bottom. And I may not want that. So let me know, show you a way around that. I simply click on the video and I'm going to go into my tools menu and power tools and crop zoom and pan. And now I notice my aspect ratio is one to one. By the way, you can also get there by simply going to the crop zoom and pan and you can change your aspect ratio. I could change back to a 16 by nine here, but we're going to go to the one to one. And now what I'm going to do is change the uh, part of the video that I happen to see on the screen. We're going to crop zoom or pan in, keep the aspect ratio normal and shrink it to this size and click on OK. Now I have a one-to-one -one video that is both square and fills the screen. So I can play this and now I have a square video. We'll stop it right there and if I produce it it will tell me my ratio is exactly what I set at the beginning. I'll go to produce and we'll do a quick MP4 here. So I finished producing my video and I see I have it here in my media room. Here's my square. If I right click on it and look at properties of the video and go to details, I see I have a 480 by 480 true square video. And so I can play that and uh, let's click on it, for example. So when I go to play it, you see that I have a truly square project that I've produced in the new version of PowerDirector. And you can also get it as well if you're a subscriber to the 365 model. One nice new feature, we'll have more to show you in the lessons to come.